uh, do it. It's just really rough sketches. I didn't do anything too serious. I'll do that when I actually start coloring some things in. And uh, if you look, like I actually put some slashes on certain spots, and that lets me know where I want to color it in and other areas. If I don't have a slash, I want to leave it hollow. And um, like for anybody that wants to do that, this stuff, I'm not saying that you need to be an artist to do it. It helps, but it's not it's not required. But one thing that you want to make sure you do is if you don't have an idea of what exactly you want to do, take the time before you actually uh, get started. Try to look at all these other designs that you actually like and try to save the pictures of them so that way when you do get started, it doesn't take you forever to uh, piece together a side. And, um, and also, uh, to pay it, like take attention to detail when it comes to uh, picking out which one you actually like the most. Because there is a uh, one thing I, I do say like shapes are better than lines, and at a tiny time lines are better than shapes. And basically, what that means is you have to have a good balance. You don't want to have too much of one thing and too much of and not enough of another thing. But also at the same time is you don't want to have too many just just abstract shapes like this and just that. You want to have something that at least at least somewhat organic like this, give it a little curvature. It doesn't have to be like oak leaves or anything like that. Or you, start, you want to give it something that uh, basically like the human eye. We all know nature can't make these shapes. And like with that being said, the human eye doesn't really pick up on it as far as like an attention getter because it's not natural. So giving it some type of organic look actually helps it out to to grab attention and if that's what you're looking for then you might want to look at a lot of that. Like one thing that that probably look really good and I'm not a gun person, but if you look at like some handles of custom pistols and everything like that, you see they have a lot of organic curves and a lot of uh shapes like that and I'm pretty sure that'd be really cool if somebody did something like that. And so I guess that's an idea for someone to look at. But uh, I'm about to go ahead and finish this up, and I only got the left side and the tank to do left, and then it'll be all reassembled. So hopefully I'll be done by <laughs> this weekend, I guess. I don't know. All right.